She's running sweet, my friends. She's running super, super sweet. The storm will be upon us in about six hours. She's just getting warmed up. Greetings, YouTube. Uh, I just want to show you some changes I've made to the setup before the storm comes later on tonight when there'll be far too much carnage going on to worry about any of this stuff. Uh, still running this meter uh, via the shunt. Uh, I've put the these cables go to the battery. Uh, you can see I've got the rectifier in place. Uh, the Chinese one. Okay, it's a good bit of kit, but the brake's just going to be going on and off constantly. It's a bit of a waste of time. Sorry. The idea with the rectifier is to allow the turbine to get up to as high voltage as it can, really. Uh, so there you go. The wind's, I'd say, about 20 miles per hour at the moment. We have the inverter connected without the device because the device started smoking when I was running the 400 watt load. So that's how it's going to be. If it's really howling, what I want to do is I want to get the welder plugged in to the inverter and see if it will run it because we're only running a 400 watt lamp off it at the moment. And yeah, as I say, the, sorry, I'm mumbling a bit. As I say, the inverter device uh, wasn't up to the job. Maybe I was completely thinking it's the wrong thing. So we're not going to be running with that. So we're going to be automatically doing unplugging to turn that off. And then the, the voltage of the turbine can go up like so. Anyway, like I said earlier, my friends, that is very good news. She's running a tree. Hardly any, you see a little bit of wobble when it's turning, but I can't see any when it's sitting straight, which is most of the time. Oh, I stand by the two sets of blades uh, because I like the power it produces. We may well see one day change of blades, I don't know. But for now, we're running about 20 mile an hour and expecting uh, we're expecting, I should imagine it will hit 60 for an hour or so. But yeah, the turbine's running great. The batteries can just fill up of their own uh, devices and get good thrashing. When it starts getting really windy, I'll take a note of the time and I'll clear the uh, watt hours off the display. Sorry, one final thing. What I've done is I've put this on there. And basically what I have to do is if I want to break it, I need to remove this, these cables and stuff them in there. It wouldn't, doesn't matter which one I stuff them in, but that's the point. And then remove these cables, uh, and sorry, remove it here and plug this in uh, to this block. So that'll break it at the rectifier. Okay, I must make a note to disconnect the batteries first before I do that, just in case. But yeah, that's running pretty well at the moment and it's gonna get super stinkily windy later. I'll see you soon. Sweet.